Okay, so I'm going to teach you guys how to calculate what a certain item will cost or add to your electric bill. There are two triangles. Okay, you see those? And E here. E stands for voltage, I stands for amps, and R stands for resistance. Okay, and on this one, W stands for watts, E stands for voltage, I stands for resistance. <coughs> okay. There are three steps to find the watts. On any item, you're looking to find the uh, there's a nameplate. It's probably not much bigger than your hand. A little nameplate. It'll say uh, the volts and the amps required to run this machine. Uh, I did a window air conditioner. Okay, so you take the watts. It'll, this is just simple math. It'll say on the name the the bracket on the bottom of your whatever you're looking at the watts divided by the volts divided by or the watts equals uh, the volts times the amps so I did the air conditioner I was talking about the window air conditioner and said 220 volts at, at minimum to run and times 30 amps you do the math and I got 6600 and say I ran it 24 hours a day so I took it times 24 and then I got 158,400 and then step three is divide by a thousand to get kilowatt hours because that's what the power company will charge you by and uh, 158,400 divided by 1,000 equals 158.4 kilowatt hours and there's another step but I didn't have enough room for it and it's on my piece of paper um, you take 158.4 kilowatt hours times 10 cents because that's how much the power company will charge you but uh, it's different in every place. I mean, back where I used to live, it's 12 cents. Here, it's 10 cents. It's just different. And if you do that, you get 15.84 to run for 24 hours. I don't know if you guys can see that, but you get 15.84. Sorry, my mic's or my my camera's really bad. 15.84 to run a window air conditioner for 24 hours nonstop. Uh, if you like this video, subscribe. Um, if you don't like it, I mean, you don't have to like it, but. If you want to see more, subscribe. Thanks.